We're using the Scribble app and let's import our video. Click on the plus, go to video beta test and it's still in beta, but that's okay. It still works pretty good. Click on the plus to import your video. I'm going to select this clip and hit the check mark to import the video. Down here in the bottom, we have all of the frames for our video. This app is very intuitive and it's a simple, simple interface. Let's go to frame 30 and with our fingers, we can pinch and drag to zoom in. And up here, we can click on this icon, this palette, and we can change the color. We can also change the size. Let's make it six. And we can disable the glow or enable the glow. And this option is pretty handy, show previous frame drawing. So make sure that you have selected and I'll explain to you why in a minute. Let's go back and let's start drawing our lines. Let's go to the next frame. And on frame 31, you can see that they give us a guide where we previously drew that line, which is really helpful when we're drawing these lines. So let's go ahead and let's keep adding lines. And let's start making them disappear. So draw one less line. And we can go back and let's play back. And when you're ready to export, click on this button up here in the corner and you can export and just hit the export button. Now I have two recommendations. Number one is to use a stylus to make these line animation. You can see I have a Galaxy Note 8, has an S Pen and it's a lot easier if I'm using it with this stylus. And the second one is if you want to dive deeper into animation, definitely check out this book called The Animator's Survival Toolkit. Now, animation is a skill. It takes practice. Practice makes perfect. Don't think I made this on my first try. It took me several tries, several times, just experimenting to see what works best. And remember that life is truly a gift, so make it count.